the book of inside information. It'd be more impressive if I didn't hit the microphone. What is the book of inside information? Why am I holding it? Why am I holding the doctor's wealth preservation guide? Why am I holding about $1,000 worth of portfolio covers? We're going to get to all that. I'm Mark McKay. Welcome to Sage Smart Solutions. Please join us weekly to learn new and exciting ways to protect your assets and retire tax-free. Marcy's in Lubbock this time, saving the world, but uh, she'll be with us again next week. Um, I, I wanted to... I was actually going to take the day off, but uh, I, I wanted to get this story out there. I was I was looking for um, for a book the other day. We've we've got a, a friend that's got a four year old that uh, you know just the brain is just he's soaking it all in. And I've got this. It's called like the Great Book Book of Everything, and it's got you know how does a twelve ton crane work, and you know why did the dodos go extinct, that kind of thing. And I just thought he'd love it, so I was looking through. Um, actually, that old armoire there, looking for, uh, you know, old books, which shouldn't be hard to find. It's about this big. But I, I came across the book of inside information. And I and I didn't remember um, where I'd come across that. Um, let me get rid of this real quick. But um, I, I used to, I used to um, my office used to share a wall with um, what became a, a fundraiser for a for a women's shelter that it was a thrift shop and they had a pretty good book section so i'd go in there and, and peruse the books and visit with uh some of the women who ran the place but um i thought maybe i'd pick it up there but i i think what it is is there was a uh there may still be but there was a newsletter um which is kind of like an email you and i'm not gonna make those jokes um called bottom line personal and it was like a bottom line financial i don't know if it was i don't remember it um but it uh, i think it was i think it was pretty much during the 80s when you know technology was coming along things were changing rapidly but we didn't really have the internet you know we we got aol towards the middle and latter part of the decade but um you know, so a lot of this information was hard to come by, and and I grabbed it thinking, okay, I'm going to uh, I'm going to spoof on it a little bit, and it says it covers everything from money, health, home, collecting, um, collecting. It's got an actually pretty interesting section on if 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 you know using collectibles as a hobby or as a, an investment, um, some stuff you wouldn't think of. But so so I grabbed it and I thought, you know what, I'm going to goof on it when it tells you that the best way to make sure that your stocks don't go down is to put hydrogen peroxide soaked cotton balls and you know that kind of thing. Um, and so I just grabbed it and I said, I'm going to talk about the, uh, the 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 first the first subject I come to when I open it. And and like I said, I was ready to kind of goof on it. And the first thing I pulled to was a fairly concise one and a half column article on split dollar insurance. And I looked at it and it's, it's, it's well written. Um, and then I realized that the whole category is on estate planning. And obviously with some of the tax law changes, um, which they don't get into a lot of specific advice here, um, but, but some, when it comes to retirement planning and, and taxes, some of that information has changed. A lot of the, you know, it doesn't take into to, to factor uh, Roths and, and, you know, a lot of the index products that have become available. Um, but, but some of the basic information about homeowners insurance, buying your first home. So this, this, would, this would make a great gift for, that right gra for the right graduate um, on your list. And that's, that's why I had the, uh, all the portfolios. I know that's real professional, but um, <laughs> I kind of laughed. I was looking when I was looking through it. I found lots of um, very nice graduation presents that my uh, my son received, and um, yeah, hopefully his godfather's not watching right now. But uh, you know, these things aren't cheap. And I was thinking, you know, w when you get them, you're like, "That's nice," and I appreciate you thinking of me. But then, wouldn't it be nice if something that you'd had that five years later, ten years later, you know, I probably had this for thirty years. Um, and it's not, it's not going to be right for everybody, but if you've got that person that, that doesn't mind, um, you know, a book, <laughs> um, which, which I also want to, want to talk about, there, there is some very concise information. Some of it is going to be out of date. And so you think, well, why wouldn't I just use the internet? Um, and, 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 and I, I thoroughly agree that, that the internet and the access to information and knowledge is, is the, you know, the, 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 
levels the playing field. Um, but it is nice to have a resource that you can go and pull. I sat at my desk and, and I was, I was going to spoof on it, but I got distracted and I spent about 30 minutes reading interesting articles, um, public schooling for children with learning disabilities. And I, like I said, I realize all that's on the internet, but you sit down and you start reading an article on your phone and the distractions and, and you've really got to question your, you know, you don't really know, um, you know, what the sources are. And, and, you know, I've seen some stuff, I've quoted some stuff. And then about six weeks later, you're like, that doesn't sound right. And you know, that someone was stating an opinion, like it was fact. Um, but anyway, for, for those of us who still like the feel of, uh, the paper every now and then, um, I, I enjoyed going through here and thinking, um, I, I don't know how much I can attest to their marriage advice on combating jealousy and infidelity, but it's there if you want another opinion. Um, <laughs> recognizing your need for solitude. <laughs> he has no need for solitude. He's uh, very codependent. Um, anyway, I think this would make a great gradu uh, graduation present for, for a lot of people, or, you know, like a newlywed present, maybe maybe to go with a plate serving or, you know, whatever people give for wedding gifts. Um, but then I also wanted to, uh, I ran across this, which is a book that we use a lot in our, in our work and, and with our practice, but it's the doctor's wealth preservation guide. And it's similar, but it's all, you know, it's, it's, it's all wealth and, and, and retirement planning and, and money related. Um, but it's a great resource. And you think, you know, what was that one rule about the profit sharing plans? Um, you know, this one, though, um, oh, okay, let me go back to the book of inside information. I'm sorry, I'm all over the place. I recorded it, had a coffee, realized the audio was bad on the first one, so here we are. Um, I was thinking, you know, this is neat, but it's probably 80 bucks on eBay because they're out of print. You know, the, the last copyright I could find in here was 89 Looked on Amazon, it's under six bucks. Um, I, I, that may be used, but, um, you know, you can get... Uh, you can get it under 10 bucks, I think. So I think it's, you know, it's not bad to have around. Um, prop the door open on a windy day sometimes. Um, anyway, that one you can get on Amazon, you know, for six bucks. Check it out. The Doctor's Wealth Preservation Guide is put together by a colleague of ours and is available if you work with us. Um, we do have a, a, a PDF version available for uh, physicians who are interested in Starting that plan planning process, whether you need some sort of a buy-sell agreement, um, you know, non-qualified deferred compensation plan, you know, or the biggest, the biggest thing that these uh, medical practices, orthodontists, chiropractors, get that cash flow working for you. Especially if you've got family members on the payroll, we can make it work so well. Get that cash flow working to you. You fund the vehicle. Put all your expenses on the credit card. You know, put the gas for the for the King Air on the credit card. Pull money out of here at the end of the month. You know, you see, you can get velocity, you can get float, you can get leverage very safely. And we can teach you more about it using the Doctor's Wealth Preservation Guide. So, book a call now. If you would like to find out about the big, the book of inside information, type it into Google, I mean to Amazon or Google. If you would like to find out more about the Dr. Cole Preservation Guide, book a call now. Let's protect your assets so you can retire tax-free. Have a great weekend.